health works, any hockey dad or soccer mom can tell you sports gear gets stinky and it is tough to get clean. But an expert in the field shows us how ozone gas can get the job done. Let's face it, win or lose, the fast-paced competition on the ice can lead to one big stink. The gloves and blockers and helmets always get the stinkiest because your hands are sweating. This is always a problem. Apparently, it's a problem for the whole family. Do you ever smell your brother's hockey equipment? Yes. How's it smell? Terrible. That's what brings us to Precision Blades in Gross Point Woods. The store owner happens to be the head equipment manager for the Red Wings. He knows the problem with stinky gear goes well beyond the smell. The bacteria that's growing is, as it grows, that odor comes out and it's eating away at the foam that's inside. So your equipment is less effective to protect you, but you're also putting your own skin at risk to pick up, like I said, a staph infection or MRSA. MRSA is a type of staph infection that is tough to kill with antibiotics. It sneaks into your body through a cut or scratch, causing a minor problem or a potentially deadly infection. MRSA is mainly spread by person-to-person -person contact, but can be spread through contaminated objects like shared sports equipment. Okay, so these are hockey gloves. These are hockey gloves. Are they stinky? They're not too bad. They're not too bad. They're not we've, great we, either. we've had worse, <laughs> but they do need to be sanitized. So Sanitizing sports gear is tough. Is That's where fresh right gear comes right. in. It looks like a metal cabinet, but it's actually an ozone gas generator used to naturally kill bacteria. The ozone gas comes through the ports and okay. it goes directly in into the piece of equipment. Go ahead and hit the start button. Okay, here we go. That's it. Ozone gas consists of three oxygen atoms, which helps to blast away bacteria and viruses. Hockey mom Katie Jordan says that's a big improvement over her usual method. Before this, I would just take a, a Lysol wet wipe and wipe out the inside, which really is just taking care of the surface. Yeah. All that hockey equipment has the foam in it and the leather, and it absorbs the smell and the bacteria, and I want to make sure that it's gone. And it's not just for sports equipment. It's very effective for smoke-damaged items. Firemen use it for their coats. Police use it for their Kevlar vests. All done? Takes 20 minutes for most things to get the full ozone treatment, and then the sniff test. Here's a test. I'm afraid. <laughs> oh yeah, that's better. A definite improvement. The cost is about $35 to run equipment through one cycle. Sometimes it takes two cycles. We'll put a link to the Fresh Gear website on myfoxdetroit.com. That's HealthWorks. I'm Dina Santafonte.